Welcome back, everybody. It's time to lock down another booster cracking, and today we are jumping back into the Pokemon celebrations. We've got a couple pin collection boxes here, and uh, we're going to start off with the nice Charizard box. The Memories box is an exclusive one from GameStop. It's got Sylveon in it and the Lance's Charizard with some really cool stuff and a cool pin. So we're going to open the sucker up and get into more of those celebration packs and try to complete the set, find a golden Mew, let's see what we can do. This thing is mighty big, so I'm gonna try to put it in the camera to see what's inside here, but it's barely gonna fit. Look at that, oh my gosh, it's a huge box. But as you can see, we got a couple of V cards, a Dark Sylveon, Lance's Charizard V, a nice coin pin. We'll go into all these further too. We got some packs and the celebration packs, and then of course a nice big jumbo mumbo card. So that's gonna be pretty sick to put in my new binder. So let's open this bad boy up. I'm gonna have to do it on this camera because there is not enough room down below, so let's slide it out carefully here. Ooh there we go. Let's, ooh, what's in here? Ooh, oh, that's a little bit better. Now we can at least take off this plastic, this noisy, noisy plastic. Oh, oh, there it goes. All right. We gotta carefully remove our nice little V cards. There we go, there's one. Woo. There's two. Let's check these out really quick. Here is Lance's Charizard V. Super dope looking card. Nice V card. Everybody loves the Charizard. So I don't remember what this one goes for, uh, but I guess we'll see here. But it's a pretty sick one. Love it. Next up is the Dark Sylveon V. Uh, pretty basic. I'm not a fan of this artwork at all, honestly. It's pretty, pretty just basic and kind of lame, honestly. Eh, not a huge fan of it, but maybe it'll be worth some value. Carefully take out our nice jumbo card, Lance's Charizard V Jumbo. Let's get my binder out. I still have yet to put this Snorlax VMAX that I got with this purchase. They actually gave it to me for free when I got this at GameStop, so I gotta put this one in my binder. Slide this guy out. Ooh, yeah, he is sick. I love this VMAX card. I don't know how great these binders are, so I'm just gonna kind of put these guys in the middle slide it in there we go bang boom all right into more shiny stuff here let's get out our nice little coin lance's charizard coin look at that beauty that is a really dope one too nice and big not super hefty obviously it's just the little plastic but these pins can go for like 10 bucks sometimes or not pin i keep calling it a pin coin these coins can go for like 10 bucks sometimes so i'm sure a charizard one will be pretty popular okay let's get to the pin though let's pop this sucker out here and take a look at this sylveon pin that is awesome i've been collecting the pokemon pins for a while since back when i started the channel i love the little mini pin collections they've had so whenever these come out i try to snag them here and there if they're a good deal or something obviously these were a little bit more expensive but i didn't mind because of the celebrations incentives that these had but really cool pin nonetheless all right we got two packs we got darkness of blaze and battle styles we'll open those up in a little bit and then we got six packs of celebrations i can't wait to get back into these Woo! there we go there we go let's start with the battle styles right let's just go into that we'll open this one up we'll get into some celebrations and then we'll see the darkness ablaze later on so frillish on the top again i don't do the for the front thing i don't mind for these whatever you know gilgar we got a spoopa as a reverse behind it a boltund as our rare nothing great but here's the cody whoop there we go celebrations it's on let's get into them i feel like in the trainer box i got uh i didn't get like a huge huge variety unfortunately uh i got a lot of doubles a lot of different stuff i am pretty close to completing the set obviously it's only 25 cards so you know it's not too bad but man if i could only get into these packs that'd be awesome all right but let's get into these we need the golden mew and we need to find a charizard reprint from that limited set so reshiram which i got palkia i got a bunch of him in the last one dude that's a nice one though here comes team rocket a good reprint card to get let's see what's behind it bang yes the classic rosy red cheek pikachu let's go i wanted this one and i didn't get to pull him yet I'm very happy about this. Not super expensive. None of these Pikachu carts are extremely expensive, but they're a lot of fun to pull. And this is by far my favorite one. It's just, it's classic. You can't beat the classics. Go guard. There we go. That one opened up easier. All right. We got Kyrie on top, which is a dope card. Probably not saying that right. I don't know. I keep forgetting how to pronounce that one. Xerneas though. I need this one actually. This is one I have not gotten yet. 
So very thrilled about this. Look at how dope he is. He is so cool. Let's see if we got a reprint. We did not. It's just a Cosmo one or however you want to say it. But let's see what's behind. Professor Research. Yeah, I'll take it. I'll take it all day. Give me more Professor Researches. Do you want the Golden Mew though? So I'd love to see him next. But this isn't a bad poll whatsoever. It's a good one. My one friend just completed his collection, his 25 cards. The last card he pulled, of course, was the Golden Mew. It was very hard for him to find, but he got a lot of these packs to go ahead and find that one. Uh, pretty cool though. Xerneas again, nice. I like it. Behind it, another Dark Gyarados. We got this in the trainer box. This is freaking awesome. I am a huge fan of this card. It's super sweet and really harkens back to the nostalgic days of my collecting too. I never had this card, but it was also, it was just an awesome card to, to see and, and want to have. <laughs> All right, behind it, let's see, let's go. I gotta focus here, let's go. Come on, we got a flying Pikachu. Co-card, flying Pikachu V, let's go. Not too bad, not too shabby. Let's just keep getting these nice V cards, yeah? Let's take a breather with some Darkness Ablaze. Let's open this one up and see what we can get. We got a, what is that, Toxel on the front? Oh, wow, wow, this one's sticking to the back. We don't want that, come on. All right, Toxel. There we go, cool looking Pokemon. Sinistee, a Carablast, I'm not centered on the screen, my bad. Melton, a Marini. Ah, your Sering as a reverse, and then behind it we've got an Octovish. Yeah, none of these uh, extra packs that we've been getting in this box have been very good, not a lot of good stuff. Three packs left, let's get into it. All right, first one, let's go. I think opening from the bottom seems to work better for me on these, I don't know, maybe. Let's see what the first card is. Xerneas on top. Okay, okay. Ooh, 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 ooh. Careful now, careful now, careful now. There we go. Xerneas. There we go. Cosmog. Love that card. Ooh, Imposter Professor Oaks Trainer. Man, I've been getting a lot of doubles. I want some variety here, guys. Come on. Good reprint card, though. Let's go. Let's see what we got behind. We saw Sagaleo. Sagaleo. Galeo. I don't know. I can't say it. Next up, let's go. This one opened very oddly. All right. Careful. Easy. Let's not show the back card here yet. Cosmoan, we got a Lugia, a classic. Another, oh my gosh, my third Dark Gyarados. This is ridiculous, I've gotten so many of him. Holy crap, he's not a super expensive one. Um, I have nothing else I can say about him that I haven't already said, it's a cool card, but let's see what's behind. We got Zacian V, uh, very nice, another repeat for my end, but that's okay, he's a cool one. Not worth a whole bunch, but he's pretty sick. The last pack, let's get into it and just cross our fingers for something awesome and interesting. Let's go. I know it's asking a lot for a Charizard. I'll even take, you know, a shiny Magikarp or uh, Blastoids or something like that from the reprint slot. So Yveltal on top, pretty sick, pretty sick. Cosmogi Mogi Man behind it. Ooh, Gardevoir EX, very cool. I don't know if I showed that bottom card, but that is a nice one. I'll take that. That's sweet. All right, a new reprint. I will, I will take it. That's that's a cool one. Behind it, we got just the basic Professor Research. It's a cool card, but I've got like five of them now. Really quick, some pulls of the day. Let's just recap on these awesome reprints that we got. We got Gardevoir EX, which is a pretty sick card. We got our double Dark Gyarados, which is insane. Behind that, we got our Zacian V, our Flying Pikachu V, and then another Professor Research. Yes, yes, yes. And behind it, my favorite one that we got today, the nice little classic nostalgic Pikachu, the rosy red boy here. Very, very nice. Hopefully you guys enjoyed, and if you did, make sure to leave a like on the video. Helps me out and subscribe. We're almost to 900 subscribers. We're on our way to the 1K. We're getting there, we're getting there. But you're not gonna wanna miss out on all the other cool products that we have around town here. We're gonna be opening up all of them eventually, and one of the ones that I'm gonna be opening up very soon, because I wanna be done with the celebrations, but also look for that Mew as much as I can. This is one of my last products, these two right here. We got Zayshan. Uh, Celebrations pin collection, and then we got a nice little tin down here that I'll probably do eventually as well. I want to open up these celebrations and find that. So if you want to come along in the journey with me, make sure to subscribe, and we'll see you in the next video.